Hi right, guys, Ryan Aluano here with this in-depth video on how to make your life just a little less sucky. We're all busy people and don't have time to do the tasks we have planned one by one, so we need to multitask. That, that being said, have you ever wondered the proper way to clean your electronic electronical devices like laptop, cell phone, or tablet? No, follow me. <laughs> hey guys, ain't nobody got time to clean themselves and all their electronic devices. So what you gotta do is run yourself a nice hot bubble bath and bring you and your electronics into the bath. I have my older laptop here. We just got dirty because um, just over time, uh, but I watched a lot of Pornhub. And I got my cell phone. And I got my tablet. So to clean your laptop, you can take your loofah and clean the outside. Clean the screen. Close. But you've only cleaned the surface area. There is a lot more to a laptop and a computer that meets the eye. You need to clean all the internals. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna close it and you're gonna submerge it. You can put it under your bum. Oh. Okay. For your tablet, it's the same procedure. Clean the exterior. And you can submerge it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's elbow. <laughs> After the devices have been submerged for at least sixty sec sixty seconds. Fuck I'm hungry. Once you have submerged your device, you can ensure that it has reached the innermost depths of it. Cleansing. Now you're going to want to take your cleaning stuff. And put it on the surface. No. You may have been to the body shop or different places to sell lupus or different things to clean yourself. And 
as you clean yourself, you can also clean in, um, in the keyboard. Uh, make sure you're quite liberal with how you apply it because chances are you haven't cleaned your device for a long while. The longer you let it wait, the cleaner it's going to be, so you can proceed to let it uh, soak and submerge. Move on to one of your smaller devices, like there's lots of stuff in here. <laughs> your tablet. There's no such thing as water damage. They put that on there to scare you away from buying their devices or if you want to use them for underwater filming or anything. It's a fucking marketing scam. You don't have to buy waterproof stuff to film underwater. You just got out of the balls to do it. Waterproof, it's all waterproof. So the same thing, let it submerge, let it clean itself. Move on to your cell phone. Now the longer you let it sit, probably the cleaner it's going to be, but you do have to rinse it off at some point. Come out of their device, 
The device has been rinsed and you can hang it to dry. The best way to hang it to dry is you can use the towel rack that is in your bathroom. So we just prop it up and hang it on your towel rack and it will dry. And before you start the device, you gotta make sure that your, 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 your device is 100% dry. With the tablet, it's a little trickier. But still rinse it off. Just make sure when you're drying it, that it is propped up, up and down. It doesn't matter if it's upside down, but you just can't have it flat because the water won't escape. So you gotta keep it upright. Same with the cell phone. And that's how you multitask to clean your electronic devices.